Hey guys, ITP here. We're looking at Scribble Notes Unlimited. It's a game made by Fifth Cell. And uh, if you've never played a Scribble Notes game, basically what this is, it's a uh, it's a puzzle game. With the uh, the tagline being anything you can imagine, you can create. And uh, I know what you're thinking, ITP. That sounds like a load of crap. But you'd be wrong. You'd be so wrong. <laughs> you can create anything in this game, seriously. Like, if you ever wanted to see a zombie machine gun down a baby, here's your chance. And, uh, that's enough talking, let's just get into it. And, um... Our story I guess I'll shut up while the cutscene rolls. And Grandma Julie. You might not believe this, but Grandpa Edgar used to be the world's greatest adventurer. Grandma Julie would beg to differ. She was also an adventurer. Edgar would often brush away vines or open doors thought to be undisturbed for generations, only to find Julie was already there, having lunch. They competed like this on adventure after adventure. On one adventure, Julie beat Edgar to the top of a long-lost pyramid. But the treasure she found was an engagement ring. The two of them semi-retired to start a family, and they continued starting that family until they had 42 children. Oh my god. 42. Mom and Dad gave Maxwell and me two amazing gifts. The first was a magic globe that let you travel anywhere in the world. The second was the most amazing notebook. This notebook let you write any word in it. And poof, the word would come to life. Our parents were worried about us turning out to be spoiled little brats. So they sent us out to face the challenges of the outside world. On the road to the city, we ran into an old man who said he was hungry. Maxwell made something to give him, but he played a nasty trick. The apple was rotten. Oh, the old man spat it out as soon as he tasted it and was very, very angry. As he cast some sort of magic, he called us spoiled little kids and then disappeared. It didn't seem like anything had happened. But when Maxwell turned to continue down the road, I couldn't follow him. The old man had put a curse on me that was turning me to stone. We didn't know what to do. Luckily, our brother Edwin's farm was nearby. Boy, you should have seen how angry Edwin was. He couldn't believe what we did to the old man and said we probably deserved what we got. Lucky for us, Edwin knew about starites. Starites are magical objects born out of the happiness of others. When you do enough things to make others happy, you will find Starite. Hopefully, if Maxwell used the notebook's power for good, he could collect enough Starite to remove the curse. Maxwell said, That's it! I'm gonna go out and do good things for all the people I can find. I'm gonna get all the Starites in the world, and I'm gonna make you better, Lily. So Maxwell grabbed his notebook and headed for the door. Yeah, there we go. Um, guys, um, I'm probably going to get back into live streaming again. And, um, if you this is the first part, I'm not live streaming this, but if you're interested, I'm going to be live streaming this game every single night, probably a couple hours. Um, I'm living in Australia, so I don't know how that would translate to uh, my American friends and others, but, um, Uh, I'll just quickly say this and then we'll get into the game. But I'll put an announcement video up on YouTube just before I start live streaming, letting you know when it's going to happen. But yeah, if you'd like to, you can um, catch me live playing this game. Otherwise, I'll upload the video from my live stream probably the following day. Yeah, alright, that's that. Alright, here we go. See, we have to clean this pig. And here's how the notebook works, right? You write in any object and it comes to life. Brush, yeah, pretty creative. I know. Give it to Maxwell, and let's uh, clean us a pig. We 
can get rid of the brush and the pig looks great. Now use an adjective to increase the pig size. Is Jimongus a word? I don't think so. I'm just going to use massive. Massive Jimongus. Help the pig win the talent competition. Use an adjective and a noun to create wings large enough to carry the pig. So let's write in giant angel wings. And there we go. We can put this in our backpack to store for later. And let's watch these guys judge our pig. It's alive! That was a very intelligent conversation they just had. Yeah, those two pigs ain't got nothing on our pig. Now yeah, we earn star rights from helping people, okay, or shards from helping people. Ten shards will form a star right, and yeah, okay. Let's use our star right vision. Help the sprout grow. Um, water can. Try something else, fine. Um. Uh, hose? <laughs> Man, I'm so creative today. What have we got? Hey, we do have a hose. Okay, we probably need a water source, right? A pond! Okay, rain. Okay, I'm an idiot, I guess. I'll just follow what you tell me, computer. Oh shit. So I guess I probably shouldn't be using language in a such a childish game where you can create zombies to eat babies and stuff. <laughs> I don't even know how this game got rated PG or whatever it is, so that's in Australia. Well, the notepad can create many things. Vulgarity, copyrighted materials, and proper nouns are not allowed. Well, that's no fun, is it? Alright, let's help her. My kitty is stuck on the top of the tree. Get her for me. I got this, guys. I could climb a ladder like that. Pick it up, damn it, Maxwell. <laughs> it's, um, whoa, whoa, my ladder. Okay, seriously, this is, this is bugging me. How do we, there we go. Right now, I can't turn it. Thanks a lot, cat. Yeah, there we go, that worked. I'm gonna try this once more. Ah! Gotcha. Oh, you can jump. I did not know that. In case you're wondering, no, I haven't played far into this game. This is about where I got up to. Just so I could learn the basics so I didn't look like a complete idiot when, um, yeah. Oh, cool, we get to make our avatar. 
Looks like a bit of a hillbilly. Uh, edit. And create our own objects, that's pretty cool. Let's make him a bit short. Not Edward, he can be Elric. If you get the reference, he would have to be a lot shorter though. I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> In fact, uh, yeah, that'll have to do. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just gonna play as Maxwell. Alright, we've completed the farm. Let's get out of here. I want someone to entertain me. Okay. What would be entertaining? I don't know. Let's get him a jukebox. Ah. Are you entertained, good sir? Guess not. Ball in a cup. <laughs> Probably pushing it a bit with that, aren't I? I can't believe I can't think of something that would entertain this guy. Let's get him. I don't know. My my imagination is severely limited today. Let's give him a guitar. <laughs> that kid is not easily entertained. I'm just going to leave him for the time being. car has been parked illegally. Graffiti? What? What is this? Let's get another one of my brushes out. Hooray! Place someone into the phone booth to make a sidekick. Okay, um... Tell me there's a Jesus. Alright, fine. Jester. He sounds pretty cool.
We're on fire now. Except for that kid, there's no way I'm going to entertain him. Carnival games. Throw something to knock over the bottles, but don't cross the barrier. Hey, I'm a clown. Sweet. Celebratory jumps. throw this time. Can we throw a baby? We can! Oh, and I can't hold it. Get out of here, baby. I don't need you then. Yes. <laughs> this guy wants to sail across the sea. Let's give him a jet ski. Jet boat. That'll do. Good luck, old timer. Okay, looks a bit creepy down here. But we'll come back to this later. Uh huh, the underline. So hungry, and this machine is empty. We need chips. <laughs> ah, carry you. I can earn some money if I learn some skills, so well, you should probably get on that then. Uh, how would you teach someone skills? <laughs> Is it as obvious as a skill book? <laughs> Let's go back to my guitar idea. Or a drum kit, yeah. Ok, 
Okay, apparently drums don't exist. I don't know why, it's because I'm in adjectives. Great object. Okay. Well, you practice that, buddy. We'll get back to you. Yes, I know what this guy needs. He wants to be a rock star. First, he needs a better instrument to help him rock out. He does. I'm gonna go. How could he this outfit? Oh, I can't go back and get my drum kit. I just have to create another one. This instrument is awesome, but my band would sound a lot better with additional members. Jenny! <laughs> Jenny's a horse. A donkey. I did not know that. <laughs> um. Electric guitar. Create a dude. Mm. Wait. That dude looks like that dude. Dude. Alright, now what do I have to do? Alright, you need a stage. We got three. Check on only at the farm to unlock new levels, okay. Sweet. Alright guys, I'm going to call it here. I know it's a shorter one, but uh, if you want to see more of this, I'm going to be live streaming it every night for a couple hours. I'll post an announcement video on YouTube when that's going to happen. Otherwise, I'm going to upload the videos from my live stream the following day. So yeah. Alright, that's it guys. I'll catch you in the next one or maybe in my live stream if you're up for it. Alright, until then, peace!